All right, so I want to view my PHP i9 settings through a PHP info command. So I'm connected to my site using the Kudu console. So in here, I have a file called my PHP info. In here, I'm going to put PHP info, save that file. And on my website, I'm going to go to that location. And here I can see all my PHP i9 settings. Okay, so one thing to take note of here is the loaded configuration file. This is the PHP i9 file location. Um, and what I'm going to do is copy it over to my D home site directory and customize it there. So I'm going to go to my Kudu console. I'm just going to go to debug command. All right, now that I'm in my console, I'm going to go to that directory that was in the PHP info, which was local config. And inside of that, uh, my current version of PHP is 5438. So I'm going to copy this PHP i9 file to D home site and I'm going to name it php54.ini. So now I'm going to go back to my D home site directory. And you, as you can see, I've already copied in um, application host.xct. And here's the php54.ini file that I just copied. So one thing you want to uh, double check is the application host.xct that the location to this is correct. D home site php54.ini. That looks right. And here's my 54i9. And one last thing before I restart the site, double check again. So this location is pointing to dlocal config, which is incorrect. So that change doesn't actually take effect until you restart the site. So I'm going to go ahead and restart my site. My site is restarting. It'll probably take a second. Let's see if it's come back up. All right, so you can see that the loaded configuration file has changed to dhome site php 54ini So we have now copied our own PHP i9 that we can customize to our liking. And that's it. Thank you for watching.